Hello, this is Chris Menard. Let me show you how to protect cell ranges in Microsoft Excel. What I don't want is people to come down here. I have the average function. I have the max function. To highlight these, press delete and say my formulas aren't working. But that's because I got rid of them. So you can set this up from scratch. Just type in whatever numbers you want right here. So here's how this works. And I'll do this twice. And around the 1 minute 50 seconds, I'll do something really advanced with it. So here's the first time. You highlight what you want people to change. You right click and go to Format Cells. You go to the Protection tab right here. By default, everything is always locked in Excel. Just take that check mark out. So you're unlocking these and everything else will be locked. Click OK. Right now, I can still change whatever I want. I could come over here and delete states. So now I go to the Review tab. So here's a two-step process. First is to unlock what you want people to change. Go to Protect Sheet and click OK. You could put a password in here. I'll do that the next time. Now, if I come over here and try to delete Florida, I get an error message because it's locked and the sheet's protected. So let's change some of these numbers. 45, 15, 25, it's working. Try to delete one of these. Can't because it's locked and the sheet's protected. So here's another trick. I'm going to go to this spreadsheet. Notice it's already filled out in quarter one, two, three, four total. I've already got formulas in them, including these percentages. So really what I want people to change is this range, this range, but I don't want to sit here and use the control key because I might mess up and plus it takes a lot of time. So here's my trick. Go ahead and highlight all your numbers, including your formulas. On the keyboard, hit the F5 function key. You can also do control G. Go to the word special and you're going to tell Excel to only select constants. Click OK, and look, that's exactly what I want. And I need to send this out to the reps in the field to fill out. So I'm going to hit the Delete key, right-click in one of the selected areas, go to Format Cells. Everything is always locked, so unlock those. And it even tells you right here the next step. It says go to the Review tab and click on Protect Sheet. So that's what I'm going to do. Review tab, I'm already there, Protect Sheet. I'm going to put a password, and here's one more little trick. I don't want anyone really even seeing my formulas. By default, select lock cells will be checked. Just uncheck it and leave it as select unlocked, and that'll be checked too. Click OK. Type your password again. Click OK. Now, what will happen is if I try to click an A2 or A3, I can't because it's locked and protected. But I can click anywhere where I need to type in numbers. So it's working. And then if you click on unprotect, if you made a mistake, you have to know the password. So hopefully that covers protecting cell ranges. Thank you.